squad, welcome back to the channel. So look, today's video, I'm gonna be giving you three exercises that's gonna allow you to transform your chest. Now, you may have seen these exercises before, but in this video, I'm gonna be giving you key tips that's gonna allow you to maximize the effectiveness of these moves. Let's get right into it. So the golden nuggets in this video is gonna be the tips that I give you to execute these movements properly. Now with the cable pec fly, you wanna think about bringing your elbows together. You wanna to drive that bicep into your chest. You wanna squeeze and pause on the concentric part of the motion, which is the part where you're going forward. You wanna pretend as if you are squeezing your elbows together. Make sure you're adding some resistance with your mind. Time under tension is the key to building muscle and building muscle is the key to burning fat. The machine pec fly is another effective way to target the chest. And just like the cable flies, you wanna pretend as if you're trying to squeeze your elbows together, you're trying to get the tip of your elbows to touch each other. I find that when I keep my arms fully extended, meaning no slight bend in the elbows, this targets my upper chest a little bit more than normal. And I love that. For the incline dumbbell bench press, I found that the key is to finding the perfect angle to set your bench at, 30 to 60 degrees, based on what gives you the best stimulus for your upper chest. You also want to focus on your range of motion. You want to make sure that your elbows are getting below your chest so that you're getting a good stretch on the eccentric part, and then pause at the top to get a good stretch on the concentric part of the motion. the oh so classic push-up. I think the key to getting all the gains out of your push-up is to pretend as if you're trying to get your chest to kiss the floor gently. Make sure you're concentrating on the motion. Go slow and controlled. Be sure to lock out at the top fully and don't allow your pelvis to touch the ground. Keep that body nice and straight. And for added resistance, throw a band around your back. I like to throw push-ups in at the end of my workout and I do two or three sets until failure. So I basically go until I can't go anymore and then I go home feeling like a winner. <laughs> 